continent that lobster copped and reach wardrobe. Do I have a, a side goal? No. Ah. <laughs> Whoop. Oh. Ow! I thought it was gonna let be easier after he got berserk. Guess I was wrong. With an air assassination again? Yep. Alright, I can do that. I wonder if I can get that. You have to dive off the top to get it. I, I... I know. Oh, I can't get up there. Oh well. This guy up there. Over there. How do I get in? You just looked at it. Where? Take a look left. Look to the left. Uh, there, there you go. It's really this way? Okay. What? The crates, then the leaning tree, then the other, other tree, and so on. Huh? Oh! I... I really don't know what to say right now. I mean, you've played more of these games than I have. This well, should. I'm trying to. to <laughs> this <commentate>. should be. <laughs> uh, uh, well, yes, you use your mouth for commentation, not your eyes. Yeah, but I'm not very good at multitasking. Oh, well, now I see why you can't find the last part in Zelda. That's not very nice. But it is true. But it's not nice. Well, I wasn't trying to be nice. Air assassination, huh? Take it, it's, it's too much to ask that I kill him from here. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, this won't be hard. Oh, come on! No! Is he running? Yep. No, you know what? I'm just reloading. This won't be hard. Shut up. I didn't expect that guy to turn around. Really? You know, you have sleep darts for a reason. This will be easy. 
Take two. This will be easy. I wonder why he's just leisurely strolling around here anyway. Checking, Seems kind of dangerous. Checking on tropes and so on. See, it was easy. Keeping the people free from your control. How free will you be when the French undermine these squabbling colonies? These colonies would be far better off without the Templars pulling the strings. <laughs> we bring order and chaos. If everything is permitted, no one is safe. You know, it's kind of odd, but I don't really believe Shay's arguments. Like in, in every Assassin's Creed game, the Assassins are always arguing with the, the Templars when they die. It's just a thing that happens. But I don't really really believe it when Shay argues with them. Shay? Of course not. It's just like an inch from the water. What do you mean you don't believe him? Like, he doesn't really argue his points. He just kind of says, like, what I would expect. Like, a half-assed, like, I know you are, but what am I kind of thing. He's like, I'll take that, you Templar dog, and the the colonies are better out from under your control. I mean, if they well, left... what would somebody else have pointed out? Well... I think that... It, uh, what would Ezio have pointed out in that conversation? I think Ezio would have been like, well, I will lead the people to freedom and I will allow them to make their own choices. Okay, well, they would have... That's basically the same thing. He just said it prettier. Shay? No. Ezio would have just said it prettier. Well, yeah, he's Italian. But... I don't know. Shay doesn't... It, as passionate as a man Shay is, I don't feel like his words have all that much meaning. It's just my impression of well, it. Well, it just goes to show that he doesn't really believe in too much of what the assassins have told him lately. I wonder how he even got into the, the assassins. Probably his family line or something. I guess so. You're going the wrong way. I want that, that um, high point thing. Ah. Hold a moment. Hold a moment. I think not. Oh. Oh. Yeah, he totally got me. But yeah, I just his words sound hollow. He doesn't argue as much as the other assassins do. Well, neither did Connor. Connor wasn't really an assassin. And Ezio didn't really argue too much either, to be honest. I don't remember he much. He pointed of out some of their flaws and what they were doing, but... I remember a little bit of some of his arguments, but not really enough. I mean, the only one who was really preachy was Altier. Altier was very preachy. I mean, Shay doesn't really have much to say in the matter, but at least he gets to the point. I guess so. But it just... The way he talks... Reminds me of, um... What does it remind me of? I, I forgot what it reminds me of. But it, uh, it makes me think that he's just repeating... You can't do that yet. Um, he's repeating things that he was told. And that's... It just further... 
brings to mind the idea that the assassins aren't really much different than the Templars in their final goals. Well, the assassins just do what they're told. Well, it's like you want to instill free thought to the people, but you don't want to instill free thought to the soldiers because if you instill free thought into them, then you then can't they'll be able to think on their own and choose for themselves. Yeah, you can't organize them properly. There has to be order in all things. <laughs> I love doing this. Try doing this in real life, folks. Yeah. But it just it's You should probably uh take a break soon to make sure the recording's not too long. Okay. Um well since nothing's happening right now, I don't think I'm in a memory. No, you're not. Okay. So I think I'll just end it right here. So we've we've talked a little bit about morality and politics. I don't think it was really politics. Probably more than we should have for a gameplay footage. To be honest, but I don't know. I guess we'll see how the people perceive. How are we it. going to entertain you with politics? I enjoy discussing politics. <laughs> to be honest, so um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed these episodes, a session. Um, if you thought the uh, the political debates were kind of boring and irritating, let us know, and we'll be sure to stay away from those topics. Um. And if you want us to talk about pop stars, well, try a different channel. <laughs> so, there you have it. Thank you for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed. I hope I didn't bore you too much or make you facepalm so bad that you gave yourself a black eye and now people at school think you're being beaten by your parents. So, was that too much? <laughs> uh. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye.